hoops in what is poppin you guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Melissa and we are can't really see it but I'm at the thrift I have not been here in so long like so so long where's my wallet that would be important I actually haven't really been thrifting because I was on vacation um, thrifting a lot for a whole entire week so when I got home I just needed to like work and like film some videos and take some depop pics and all that so I really have not been thrifting all that much so we are here and we are thrifting if you're new here welcome to my channel if you're not new here welcome back to my youtube channel it's your girl Melissa and today we will be filming a trip to the thrift we're at Tali's first so let's go and get it also make sure to follow me on all my social media I'll pop them up on the screen my Instagram my Depop my Twitter my snapchat add me up on there but without further or do, let's go. I haven't been here in so long that they fully changed up the whole entire store. The shoes are in the back. The horse is in the back. No, I'm kidding. The shoes are in the back and everything's all mixed up. And usually I have a system where I'll do like certain aisles at once. So I'm a little bit confused. So, but I am in the shoes. I always start in the shoes usually. And I did find these polo shoes, which are kind of cute. But not cute enough for $17.99, boys! No chance, okay? And then, yeah, um, so I'm just in the men's shoes right now. Oh wait, they are 50% off today, I forgot. These ones are cute, too. What size are these? Nine and a half. There's a couple pairs of Converse. Hmm, what are those? Adidas slides, these are interesting. Oh, oh, somebody donated all their polo shoes. These are an eight. These are cute too. Okay, but these are so cute. We love a Barbie Y2K BB moment. These are so adorable. Maybe I'll pick these up because, I don't know, I think that they're really cute. And that's the first in the buggy, ladies and gentlemen. These are literally Bratz doll goodness. Oh my god, they're in such great condition. And I think that they're my size. I'm literally getting these for sure. And then I also found these bad boys, which are so adorable. Livy and Rose always comes through with these like fluffy, I'm gonna kill my husband and take his Millie shoes all the time. And then I also see these toe ring. Aldo sandals, such a vibe. I used to be obsessed with toe rings in the 90s. <sighs> I need these in my life. I love finding these super little mini bags, but they're just so not practical at all. So I usually, uh, well, sometimes I get them, but like sometimes I just don't because like, like they're so cute, but like this one's actually really cute too. I don't know. I don't usually pick them up because they can be a little bit more pricey, but I do really like this one, I'm not gonna lie. Like this is super Y2K, like with a sil slip, silky slip dress. This would look so cute, so I might get this one. Okay, I found this one, which is so cute. It's this polo, um, I don't know if this is Ralph Lauren or just, what is that other one called, I forget. Oh, US Polo Assassin or whatever. I don't know. I always say it wrong. Sorry. But like, it would be cute. If this was Polo, I'd probably get this. But it's like a little mini bag. And I thought that was cute too. And then I also saw this, which I love like the whole structure of this bag. I just don't like how it says gas. I don't know. I don't like this. And I don't like this pattern. But like, if this was just like all leopard print, this would look so much cuter. Um, and then I saw like this little mini bag which is super cute too. But like, what do you even put in this? I don't know. I have no idea. And then I s like saw this little, this one's really cute actually, you might get this. This is a Tommy Hilfiger little, like very high fashion, like um, tweed-esque bag. That's super like summery, springish, which is really on trend. So I might get this one. Do you see what I see? Do you see what I see? Always, this is how I always find the Versace jeans. Literally through the rack, every single time. I'm so pumped. 
And then the other two purses that I found was this really cute coach little mini bag. And this one was just like kind of like a Fendi vibe. Little pink mini bag. I'm not too, too positive about this yet. I don't know the price on it. So I'll let you know. But it's really, really cute. So I might get this one too. And then I already showed you the Tommy Hilfiger one. And then I just found these bad boys, which I am so freaking excited about. Oh my god, I haven't been thrifting here in so long, guys. I'm too excited about this right now. There's also, like, these Adidas pants, but I'm not too sure about them. This is why I always check the, like, sport jersey section, whatever you want to call it. But they always have some pretty cool windbreakers in here, and I've been loving the, like, um, windbreakers that are, like, uh, universities or anything like that. So I found this Florida one, which is really cute. Okay, I couldn't not look at the sleepwear section any longer, so we're gonna go there. Mmm, pants too. I'm so aggressive here. I'm like, would literally sell my soul for cute vintage sleepwear. Like a hundred percent. Like no question about it. But I did like find already a couple amazing pieces. So I've been obsessed with like these slit in the middle ones they're super like a lot of um like img is selling them right now but you can literally find them at the thrift or on depop honestly um a lot of the times and i think that they're just like so y2k and i'm loving also found this calvin klein bra which i'm gonna keep for myself because uh 3.99 yes it's literally like brand new and then i also found this black like tank top it has like a cutout there so with some high-waisted shorts it looks like it will just be like cut out which i think is really really cute and I found another one of those like slits in the middle top super Y2K again from Lucenza and then I did find this really beautiful bustier piece which I think is absolutely stunning so I found this is oh, wow look at that that's so pretty and then I also found a very good dress stunning like so beautiful it's long it has like velvet with like some mesh down it and everything I also don't think I showed you guys this but I found this Ralph Lauren um, long sleeve I just kind of walked past it and picked it up in the men's section real quick we'll go back there soon as well but I'm definitely finding some cute things I also found this Betsy Johnson intimates which is super cute but um, I don't know if I love the shape of it I don't know. I don't know. I just, I feel like it's an awkward type of cami, but I do love the pattern of it. And that I just am coming across some more colorful stuff, which is really cute. Like, this is so adorable. Oh my gosh. Okay, I found the cutest Betsy Johnson jacket. And um, I know I don't really need jackets right now because summer is coming, but this is like the type of thing that I love to add to like my collection in my wardrobe of like really cool like high-end designer vintage pieces. I just like to, you know, it's a thrift thing I think. Like everybody, you know, you thrift a lot, you like to find this stuff. If it's a cool name brand, you usually pick it up. And then I found this Fruits, Fruits, look at it, Fruits jacket. It is so cute. And then this Guess Jeans. Um, little mini skirt. I love the like side tie. It's like gingham. It's cute. I love. And then I found, okay, I found this skirt. It reminds me of, I forget what brand it is, but it is like so ugly, but like so cool at the same time that I think I need to get it. I don't know. I don't know. This might be like a really, really horrible purchase, but like I feel like I need it. You see how there's an ambulance there? Well, this lady right here, who's talking to like the, the store owner or whatever, just got taken here in a stretcher. So I, did she just get out of the hospital and was like, take me to the thrift store? Cause like, that's such a mood and it's literally me. Hi, my name is Melissa and I just found the cutest dresses that I've ever seen in my whole entire life. Literally, look at this bag. I think I've actually found one similar if not the same but in a shorter version but look at this it is a long ass beautiful ass summer floral dress ass so cute and then I found this one which is also long which is super cute and beige and then I found this stunning one too which is long and it's like this beautiful floral I'm just having a grand old thrift day and we're barely 
barely through the first door. Oh my god, okay, snake print has been so big and I've been obsessed with it. Look at this dress. Oh my god, and it's like that slinky material again, so you know that it's like gonna form to your curves. I am obsessed with this. Wow. There is kind of something that I've been on the hunt for recently. Um, it is some tie-dye jeans. did find these, but these are skinny, and I don't really like skinny jeans that much. Um, and they're also low-rise, and I also don't think that they'll fit me. So, um, I don't know. I think they might be a little bit big in the waist, and then they won't fit me in the bottom part of it. Um, but yeah, I don't know. This is what I am on the hunt for. Something similar to this, at least. Oopsies. Okay, first of all, this. Oh my god, my Lantis. What size is this right now? A large. A large? A large. My, me just being really pissed off at my little boobies right now. Oh my god, it's a two-piece set. I wish there was a second piece to it, but I did not find it. I'm sad now, but still, like, this is the coolest thing ever and then I found like some good pants as well some good Nike pants I could even crop these and turn them into some bike shorts <gasps> that might be that might be the tea that might be it and then I found like a bunch of like athletic wear this champion I did find some bike shorts because you guys have been asking me where to get bike shorts so I'm gonna put some up on my depop I found I got this like two-piece set situation which I thought was really cute and then this tie-dye bottoms, which I don't know if I'm gonna get. Um, I got like this bathing suit, this one-piece bathing suit, which is purple. I got this little top, and then some pants, some really good plaid pants, juicy pants, and black pants, and then these straight pants as well, which I really am digging. Oh, and I found this bathing suit, which is so cute. And I found this bathing suit, which is so so, so cute. Look at this. This is so good for a festival or something. So I found this as well. Okay, the green, I'm obsessed and I'm definitely cropping and keeping for myself. Yes, I found this angel Tweety bird. And then I found, oh, I just needed a black basic. So I'm just gonna crop that. Um, I found some Ed Hardy. I found this Nike. I found these Nike dry fit lime green neon highlighter shorts as well. I found this Corona. And then I also found this really Y2K top that I'm obsessed with with some jeans or something. It would look so cute. And then I did find a couple pairs of Levi's 501s. I found one pair here. Um, oh, I think I didn't take the other one. Um, and then I also found this Reebok pullover um, crew neck. So yeah, that's what I found so far. And oh, I also found this M top, which I think is really cute. So you know, if your your name starts with an M, like mine, it makes sense. <laughs> The current situation is that I have too much stuff in my cart, and this was not supposed to be this full today, but I did find the coolest jacket ever. I actually think I might keep this. Um, I think it is so freaking dope. Look at it. It's like this neon. It looks, I don't know if it looks as neon on camera as it does in person, but it's a long raincoat. I feel like styled probably looks so cool. I did find this Paul Frank hoodie in red and this Jordan one. And I found these, which are like gray track pants, which I'm gonna keep probably. I don't know, a lot of the stuff I actually kind of found for myself today. Um, I found like some of this, some Lacoste, some Nike, and I did find this in the little boys section as well, so that's exciting. I don't know if I've showed you guys these two um, really cool blouses I found in the women's section as well, but yeah, I've been finding a ton of stuff. I found like this BB top, so we love a good BB top. I'm obsessed with BB. I'm gonna go look through all these t-shirts now. Yeah. Alright, so the last couple things that I found were a couple graphics, this Von Dutch 
this Nike and then I did actually find this Levi denim jacket in the men's section which is really nice actually um, it's in good condition it's a good wash so I found that I also found this Harley Davidson graphic this guest jeans graphic Kappa and this Adidas one which are like these ones are good to crop and you guys like my crops when I crop them that just was a lot so yeah let's go um, fix myself up a bit and uh, move on to the next store okay I was literally just organizing myself and I found this really cool um, Bugs Bunny like Tasmanian Devil Looney Tunes jumpsuit in the little girl section but it's an XL so I think it would actually fit like a small woman. So I'm gonna get that because that's so cool. Okay, so we're at another Value Village where actually it's actually a different day. I'm just gonna flex on you real quick. <laughs> oh, I hate myself. Okay, um, but yeah, we're at another Value Village. Your girl actually has a tripod. Ooh, fancy dancy. Yeah, so we're going to this Value Village. Um, so yeah, let's go check her out. Okay, first of all, look at this cow printed uh, blah, blah, glasses holder. I'm obsessed. And then I also found this, I first just saw this Kangle um, little polo. And then I found these two necklaces, which are super grunge and cute. It's just a cross. And then there's um, this heart, which is really cute. Thrifting cute accessories is literally everything. Look how adorable these sunglasses are. Oh my god. I don't need any more sunglasses, but I need these. <laughs> uh, I'm finding so much cute accessories. Not good, guys. And then, let's see. Look how 80s this Polo Ralph Lauren bag is. I love it so much, but not for that hefty of a price tag. But it's so cute. Oh, she is cute too. Super, I don't know, I just like these bags all the time, but I don't know if I need another one. These are so cute, but again, $17.99. I'm probably gonna pass on them, but they're so cute and they're Steve Madden. Some really cute belts. You know, I just kind of look for anything that's sparkly or grommety, to be honest, when I'm looking through the belts. Um, I also found the cutest bathing suit when I was walking past. I think that this is the, like, oh my gosh, this is stunning. It's this one piece, vintage one piece, but it's like waffled. Oh my god, it is literally so cute. So I also see that the shoes were kind of a dud, and now I'm looking at the belts. Like, anything like big and sparkly is so exciting to me because it's just, rem oh, like, I'm kind of obsessed. Anything with like a chain like this is also just too cute. Like I think that this is amazing, but it's $8.99, but like I still, no, I can't. I love it, but I can't because I'll want to keep it and then I don't need it. So yeah, so like anything like these, this is super fun to find, but I do like the leather ones better, I think. What is this? Another kind of grommet. I do really like this one, but it's missing a little stone there. I love accessories. This just makes me realize how, oh my god, look at this mud belt. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. $10.99 though, again. What are these? This looks like something that I need. Okay, I'm in the little girl section and I found the cutest little bathing suit top ever. It's like tie-dye. I think it's so cool. And I also found this one, which I think is super cool as well. It is missing some rhinestones, but I feel like I just love it so much. And I think with like a pair of jeans, it would just look like such a Y2K aesthetic. So I'm going to get this one. And then I also see this, which I love the top of it. What does the bottoms look like? Maybe I'll see, and I'm gonna. I might get this because it's probably cheap enough. Um, and then if I if I can't use the bottoms, I won't use the bottoms. Um, but 
the top is just so cute. All right, guys, so I'm going through the little girl section and the little boy section. Well, I went through all the little girl section. I didn't find that much stuff, but I found a couple things. Um, and I just came across this Joe Boxer top in the little boy section, which is so cool. But look at this old navy brand new with tags and it comes with like the sweatband thing oh my god who remembers this who freaking remembers this that is like the coolest thing i've ever seen my whole entire life i'm so pumped about it and then i also found this nike athletics i found this really cool cherry sticks girls um, very loud top which I love with the peace sign I found this bucket hat which I'm super excited about and I found this polo top which I'm gonna crop I found this cute AF butterfly top too and then this top right here which says I've been good um, buy me a pony so this was like really cute too so yeah this is what we are on the hunt for right now super exciting um, yeah I don't know we are having fun here we are having fun I also just want to see what this hat looks like on it's cute I wish I had a better view of it okay I haven't found a piece like this in so long but it's just something that I need to try on it's like this jumpsuit definitely from like the 80s it is so cool I don't know where somebody would wear this but oh my god it's only $9.99 I need to try this on and then I also found this absolutely beautiful dress like this is stunning it is so nice it's by Nygaard but guys the price of it is $34.99 and it does have like a little hole right here and a little bit of like a mark right here the mark I could get out the hole I'm not sure even how that happened like it's it's just weird it must have got caught on something but I thought it was just absolutely beautiful unfortunately I'm not gonna be able to get it because a it's ridiculously priced and b the little hole I won't be able to fix or anything but this piece is like so cool do you see this I literally might just get it and just keep it in my vintage and they have stirrups on the bottom and I think it might fit me and then I also found this stunning dress too which is super like realization par flowiness it's really cute it's a it's not um, a maxi dress it's like about a midi leg but I love dresses dresses just make me so happy okay I found the cutest little shawl snake printed thing it's a little bit long for me oh my god I still have the tag on my shirt I'm so embarrassing so but I thought it was really cute okay I did also find a couple more dresses I literally hate this is why I hate hangers in here because this happens all the time to me in the lingerie section super quickly and I did find this it's so cute they don't have like the best selection right now for lingerie but I found this dress and I think it's so adorable so, and then I also found this vintage top, which is super cute too. Um, Christmas vibes, Gucci vibes, I don't know, but I really like it. I found this little tennis skirt. I thought it was American Apparel. It is not. It's actually a vintage brand, which I like, I like, I like a lot better. I found these Ralph Lauren pants too, which are super cute. Um, yeah, I think I might keep these though because they're my size and I'm praying that they fit me. Which is dead. Nothing good. Okay, and then I also found two other dresses. So I found this beautiful printed dress, and then I found this denim dress as well. This one is so cute, so on trend. I also found these two black, I found this black mini skirt, which actually is a skirt that I think will fit me. And then this one, which I sold one similar on my Depop a couple days ago. By the way, plug, uh, check out my Depop at Melissa8, you know cute stuff and then I also found this red one too which is really cute but I don't know if about the length of it. it I love the pattern of it though and I do see something really interesting over here what is this wow wow what my goodness she's heavy I would love to know who this is by. There's no brand. This might be handmade or made by somebody at home, but it is so colorful. Oh my goodness, this is so cool. It's like this lime green long skirt. I love this. It says that it's a sample and that it was made in Germany, so I wonder what, like, who this was a sample for. I don't know. Samples. 
It's so cool though. And then I also found this um, denim uh, guest skirt that I am hoping fits me. It looks a little big, but I don't know for sure because there's a belt thing at the back to tighten it. Um, and I can also wear a belt. Guys, I met the cutest subscriber. This is Emma. Hi. Is there anything you want to say? No. No. Okay. <laughs> She's just doing some thrifting. It's Saturday. We're doing some Saturday thrifting today. Okay, I just found the cutest Liz Claiborne jeans. Also, subscribers, so cute. I love you guys so much. And um, they're high waisted. They're so cute. And then I also found these Tommy Hilfiger. Um, kind of flared jeans high-waisted, but they're super cute too. Such a throwback. Do you remember when you would DIY these? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Just remember, always remember, tips about finding coats in the summertime is there's always a better selection. So you can always stock up in the summertime. They're a little bit cheaper even too, and there's definitely more selection. So that's when you want to stock up on some stuff. I found this coat right here, which is so bomb. Like, vinyl goodness. The price is a little bit much for right now, um, but that is just like too cool. So I'm gonna look through these coats and see if we can find anything. Your girl is getting hungry, like too hungry. It's not safe out here for anybody at this point. I'm too hungry, I'm going to eat you. But I found um, a lot of stuff actually. Uh, I just came across this, which I kind of love the whole Y2K vibe of it. Um, I don't know, I think it's cute and I'm kind of into it. And then I also found this beautiful um, like sheer top yellow. I found this super Y2K vibes top. I found this beautiful purple high neck sweater top. I found this is so cute. You know, just lots of goodies. I found this Back to the Future graphic as well. Um, oh, I forgot, I found these Playboy shorts. I don't know, I just found lots of good stuff. Some Levi's, of course. I found these Levi's, and then I also found these really, really good Echo jeans in like a size 28 or something. They're pretty small too, so I'm pretty pumped about those. Um, I found these, which are like super light wash Levi's, and I'm hoping that these fit me because I'm really into the vibe of them. Um, but yeah, that is what we are looking at. Now I just have a couple more aisles to go and then I'm about to go eat, 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 eat anything in sight. I'm literally so hungry. So, ooh, what's this? We got a little fuzzy piece action happening. Okay, this is such a need. Oh my god. I'm obsessed. Oh my god, look at everything that I'm finding. He's so cute, but I have two much stuff right now too much like look at this bustier is and then i found this like justin bieber graphic but i love it it's like neon totally like one of his first t-shirts probably and then like so much fun stuff like this guys look at like oh well, that's not that interesting but like so cute so cute section okay first of all look at this tie-dye skirt oh my goodness this little denim two-piece um, bathing suit is so cute too I'm literally so in love oh my gosh look at the front of it it's so adorable so cute and then I found this like off the shoulder bathing suit as well <gasps> So cute, high cut and everything, very vintage. And look at this bathing suit. It is so 
good so good it is high cut and everything i'm obsessed i'm gonna try this on for you guys for fun and then oh my god you guys are not even ready i found this amazing sheer wide leg butterfly um jumpsuit i don't know it has it's by this brand it is so cute i am obsessed with it super on trend and aesthetically pleasing right now Ugh. this is coming home with me oh it's really the like, cute i can wear the stirrups so i can just like lift them up but like how cute is this jumpsuit literally so cute i'm so obsessed with it guys look at the detail on it like uh, I need an event to go to to wear this, but I don't really care. I will literally wear it around my house if needed, but this is literally the cutest thing I've ever seen in my whole entire life. Something you can think about, you play me good.